The college board says the average college student spends more than $1,200 on books and materials every year. But now, a bill proposed by a state Democrat could change that. WCIA 3's Moyo Adiolu has the story. One lawmaker's proposed bill will take a deeper look in public universities' cost-saving methods for required course materials. State Senator Laura Murphy wants to require schools to publish an annual report outlining the cost of textbooks to either the Board of Higher Education or the Illinois Community College Board. Director of Campus Services at Lincolnland Community College, Andrew Baylock, says his staff already works with students to conduct internal reports. A lot of the students that are coming in, they are comparing in price, but that's not the only factor. They're coming in because they want to see the service level. They want to know that they're getting the book, that they're ordering quickly and on time, that it's the exact book that their teacher is going to require of them. And so we do a lot of extra things for the student that other places really don't provide. Baylock says students who cannot make ends meet should reach out for assistance. Anybody that, you know, is looking for a student's best interest, especially in this day and age, should be looking at all of the costs, and including textbooks, and making sure that textbooks and tuition are affordable. Baylock says the idea aligns with their mission to provide affordable and accessible education. Lincoln Land says they cut the cost of books in half by offering ebooks. I'm Moyo Areolu reporting from Springfield.